All right, I just wanted to show you what I did. Seeing I don't have that roof piece or ceiling piece, I put a little spacer in there so I know how thick the piece is going to be. That way I can put my wall piece on and it's at the right height. And when I go to put my ceiling piece back in, worst comes to worst, I have to take this off, but that piece is still in the right place. So I'm hoping I can slide it in there, but I kind of doubt it. But so we'll see what that looks like. And then I got my trim corner piece in. So yeah. Not too bad. Patch of band-aids. You know. Alright guys. Thanks for watching. There's your trim. Have a good one. Alright, now we're in the bedroom. And uh, as you can see, same thing. Trim on the top and back there. I got some stuff to move, but uh, it should go pretty quick. So that's trim and bunkhouse. I'm going to move back out front and we're going to do some uh, floor moldings. So uh, let me reset up here and we'll be ready to go. Alright, so I got my uh, paneling trim up. And now we're going to put in uh, this stuff. This is just engineered trim. It's a little bit easier than running and painting and doing all that stuff with this inferior hand cut trim. So we'll throw that up, see how she looks, and uh, yeah. Let me show you what I got. Both trim pieces and then the new stuff just sits in the corner. And uh, well, it's not the best, but it definitely covers up the bad wall spots and uh, 